In this tutorial, I'll show you how to add colour to different selections of a sphere, applying multiple materials to a single object. First of all, I'm going to go to File and do New. I'm going to press Delete on the keyboard to delete the default cube. I'm going to go to the Add menu, Add Mesh UV Sphere. I'm going to the View menu and I'm going to view Front and the view menu again and I'm going to go from perspective to orthogonal view. I'm going to zoom in using the mouse wheel. Uh, before I go into edit mode I just want to look I've got 32 segments and 16 rings so there are 32 vertical segments and 16 horizontal rings. I'm going into edit mode and I'm going to go into face select mode. I'm going to drag to open up the side panel and I'm going to click on the material button. I'm going to add a new material which I'm going to call red and I'm going to click on the diffuse color and I'm going to drag here to make red value 1 and the green and the blue value 0. I'm dragging with the middle mouse button just to look down on the sphere. I'm going to select a face and I'm going to use the ALT key to continue the selection. If I hold down the ALT key and click on a horizontal edge it will select all the faces in a segment and if I click on a vertical edge it will select all the faces in a ring and if I use SHIFT to extend the selection so I'm holding down SHIFT and ALT and clicking on another vertical edge I get my two rings selected. I want to create a new white material but I mustn't click the plus here to add a new material. I must first click the plus here to add a new material slot which allows multiple materials to be linked to a single object. Now I can click the plus to create a new material. I'll call the new material white and in the diffuse color I'll drag these so that the red, green and blue values are all one. Now, in edit mode you have the Assign, Select and Deselect buttons. I'm going to click the Assign button to assign the white material to the selected faces. I'm going to select a face. I'm going to hold down Alt and click on a vertical edge to select a ring. I'm going to hold down Shift and Alt and click on another vertical edge to select another ring. I'm going to click the New Material slot. I'm going to add a new material. I'm going to call the new material blue. I'm going to click on the diffuse color and I'm going to drag to make the red and green zero and the blue one. And I'm going to click the assign button to assign the blue material to the selected faces. Dragging with the middle mouse button, I'm going to rotate the scene to see the underside of the sphere. I'm going to select a face. I'm going to hold down ALT and click on a vertical edge. I'm going to hold down SHIFT and ALT and click on another vertical edge. I want red, white, so I want white and a sign. I'm going to select a face. I'm going to hold down the ALT key, click on a vertical edge, SHIFT and ALT, another vertical edge. and I want blue, so I select blue and click a sign. Uh, I want red next, so all that's left is to color the bottom white. To select the faces from the bottom of the sphere, I'm going to go into front view and I'm going to use B select. But before I use B select, I'm going to click this button so that the selection is not limited to the visible. I'm also going to select a face from within the selection. Then I'm going to press B on the keyboard and I'm going to drag to select the bottom faces. I'm then going to select white and assign white to the selected faces. I'm going to go into object mode, put smooth on, and there we have our stripey ball. I'm going to go to the view menu and select front view. I'm going to grab the tip of the red arrow and move the sphere basically out of the way. I'm going to add mesh UV sphere. I'm going to up the number of segments to 36, which is a multiple of three. I'm going to go into edit mode. I'm going to click this button that displays available materials and I'm going to select red. 
I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five faces across. That's selected a back face. I need to turn limit selection to visible back on. And I'm going to hold down the Alt key and click on a horizontal edge to select a segment. And I'm holding down Shift and Alt and I'm going to select two, three, four segments. I'm dragging with the middle mouse button and I'm going to zoom in with the mouse wheel and I need to hold down shift and add these faces to the selection. I'm zooming back and holding, dragging with the middle mouse button, zooming in again, holding down shift and selecting these faces. Now I'm going to click the plus button to add a new material slot. I'm going to list the available materials. I'm going to select white and I'm going to assign the new material to the selected faces. I'm going to zoom back with the mouse wheel. I'm going to drag with the mouse button. I'm going to select a face. I'm going to hold down the Alt key and select a horizontal edge. And I'm going to hold down Shift and Alt and select three more. I'm going to zoom in at the top, hold down Shift, and select the four faces at the top and use it dragging with the middle mouse button hold down shift and select the four faces at the bottom I'm going to click the button select oh no I'm going to add a material slot uh, then I'm going to click the button and select blue and I'm going to click assign to assign blue to those faces I'm going to zoom back with the mouse wheel drag with the mouse button. I'm going to select one, two, three, four, fifth face. I'm going to hold down Alt and select a horizontal edge. Hold down Shift and Alt and select another three. I'm going to pick up the faces at the top and the bottom and add them to the selection. And then I'm going to apply white, assign white to them. I've skipped ahead and I've finished colouring the white and blue segments. I'm going to go into object mode. I'm going to turn smooth shading on and there we have our two spheres. That's the end of the tutorial. I'll put the finished file at my website www.freemovies.co.uk at the Blender channel there. Thanks for watching and goodbye.